Hey everyone, Nathan4071, got a great contest going, go over there and check it out. This is my first attempt at making char cloth, I didn't have an empty tin can, probably should have, but I'm sure you've all seen somebody fold it in tin foil before, that's where I look to get the idea. It's, I'm not going to build a wood fire right at the moment to do it, I'm just going to do it on my little propane stove, so I control it a little better. Well, it's hot today, so I'm just hanging out here in my shed, playing around, and uh, we'll be right back, show you how this comes out. Battery died on the other camera. That looks like a lot of flame. I don't know. I have, uh, I don't know, maybe 16 pieces of 4 inch cotton in there. I have no idea what I'm doing. I got an idea if it blows a hole out through that tin foil that this isn't going to work. And I'm not going to latch right onto that to see what's going on either. But go over to Nathan's channel, 4071. He's got a great, great contest going on. Or, or, or sub appreciation I should say and he's a great guy he's always got interesting stuff and he's a great person to have on your channel too I always look forward to his comments well, I don't know what's going on there but I seem to have a lot of fire coming out of that tin foil maybe it wasn't pure cotton but I thought it was Oh yeah, it's burned a hole right through. This isn't going to work. I'm going to shut the gas off because that's just burning on its own. Can't be that was pure cotton. I thought it said pure cotton on it. I asked my wife. She said it was pure cotton. That's kind of cool. Blew a hole right out through. I mean, I got a lot of tin foil wrapped up there. You'll see when it cools off. You can see it blew a hole right through there. I don't know what I did wrong. I'll have to see if I can find a tin can. <laughs> Try to make some that way. Well, the fire's almost out. I'm not going to open that until it's cooled down um, looks like it might be just a little bit warm but it is doing what the others did it just had a lot more flame than I think it should have but like I said I'm not going to latch on to that for a bit I'm going to grab a pair of pliers and set it on the ground so it'll cool off quicker Okay, update on the char cloth here. Um, I know what I did wrong. That my heat source was too high. I gotta go shut that off, it's still burning. But anyway, my heat source was too high and it made a hole in the tin foil. And the char cloth is actually doing what it was supposed to in the tin. So I quickly, I couldn't film it, but I grabbed a cannon jar and a lid. And I did the old hot potato, got burnt too, once. And I put it in the, the um, cannon jar, which I don't know what's gonna happen. It sealed the lid. Huh. It should put it out. Uh, I can't leave anything alone. It's been about two minutes. And I've got the, uh, it worked. It made some char cloth to do that. Um, you can see what was happening to it, that it was actually burning because uh, the, the gas was too much heat. I'm going to get a, my little tripod here. I thought it was right here on the bench. 
right here somewhere and set it on the tripod and see if it'll take a spark, that little piece. Too bad I ruined quite a bit of it because it, it actually caught on fire. But I guess that's what we wanted it to do.